Oh yeah, this is a short video, just showing some of the GDR3 features. I've loaded it onto my uh, Huawei Ascend W1, worked perfectly, no problems. I use the um, developer app, this is down here, a uh, preview for developers. Loaded that on, um, I've done it for the free version, so I've got one device unlocked. My Nokia 1020, I'm leaving that factory set because it's new and it will void the warranty. Um, but the features are there, they're good. I mean, they're, they're just simple ones, but they're what we wanted. You know, we've got the screen rotation. Works on, off. Simple. Even some apps that are now released that will let you do that from the home screen. Or the start screen, as they call it. Um, you've got uh, driving mode, which is good. And I will be using that on my um, 1020 when that gets enabled. Uh, it's really good. It, it basically... You can ignore texts and calls, but it won't just ignore them. It will, it will reply to people if they phone you and call you with that you're in driving mode, and you'll get back to them. And that's good because a lot of people send me text messages when I'm driving, and it's really annoying. And with that feature, I can set an auto reply if they please call me because it's very easy to receive a call uh, as opposed to trying to text back. But they have actually improved the text recognition, so. I might try that out. Um, what else have we got? We've got the, the phone storage, which is a bit of a mess. Um, the other storage is still a bit of a mess. Um, but this phone storage that they've got on there now just, just gives you more information, really. Um, so it tells me apps and games. I can go into that, broken down a bit more. You know, maps, email messaging, system, temporary files. I can even go and delete those, but it doesn't do anything. You press it, it just hangs for ages and doesn't do anything. Um, it just links to other settings. It's, but it's the still, it's got the other, it's still on there. Um, but it doesn't explain enough what is in the other. Because some people think, oh, it's a load of waste of space. But it is things like email attachments, your some of the SkyDrive photos you uploaded. Um, and especially on Nokia 1020 I've got. It's actually all the high-res pictures um, because the the phone software doesn't know what they are. But the Nokia Lumia check, um, storage check, is much better, and that's what they should have gone for here. I've broken down of the apps, which they haven't. But still, it's an improvement. Um, what else have they got? Um, bits and bobs in there. You know, just really, that's the two main features which I really like, um, which I'll be using. And I can't wait for them to mix it in with the Nokia features as well. 